I am going to show you my tips and tricks for taking Christmas pictures of your pets. Of course using natural light is a great idea or even going outside, especially in the early morning or in the evening before the sun sets, you can get some great pictures. However, if you do decide to use artificial light like this one for example, what I do is keep it kind of a distance away from the animal so it's not too close and I use something in front of it to kind of diffuse the light so it's not too bright. It doesn't shine right in their eyes and make them afraid or uncomfortable. When I'm not gonna take pictures or video of my pets, I start by calming them down, like gently petting them or feeding them and getting them calm and feeling comfortable. If your pet's afraid or uncomfortable at all, your pictures and your video won't turn out that good. Last year my guinea pigs were not full grown yet, so I took some pictures of them with this little hat. And um, it no longer fits them, but last year it still fit them pretty good. Um, it's stretchy and it wasn't real tight around their neck or anything. I only left it on them for just a couple of minutes, just long enough to snap the picture. And they didn't seem uncomfortable or bothered by it. So whatever you do, you want your pets to be comfortable and happy because of course you get much better pictures and videos that way. You do not want to force an animal into a really uncomfortable situation where it doesn't feel safe. You don't want it to be scared or uncomfortable at all. I personally don't put my cat in costumes because most cats don't like it. They just want to get it off of them. It makes them pretty uncomfortable. So it depends on the animal. One little trick I did with an animal is if it's just sitting there, you can take a hat and just gently set it on it right on it. Take a hat and just gently set it right on top of the animal. You don't have to, you know, tie it on there or anything and that can make it less scary and comfortable for the pet. Or you can even set it beside it. Another great way instead of costumes for the pets is to set the pet next to a cute prop. That way the pet can just sit near it. It doesn't have to wear anything or be uncomfortable.